hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i want to share how to make these delicious pots of vegetable soup or edikai kong as some people would call it please before we start please do well to subscribe to my channel and like this video so let's dive right into the introduction of the ingredients okay guys for the vegetables i'm going to be using some water leaf this is a whole lot of water leaf I have some ugu here, a lot of ugu. Let the ugu be better than water leaf because by the time I pick this water leaf now, it will be very, very small. So the ugu should be plenty than the water leaf. I also have some uzza leaves here. I find using uzza leaves very helpful for vegetable soup. It adds a very nice flavor to it. Then for the fish, I have two different types of fish here. Two different smoked fish here. I have my eggs, that is panla, and I have my black fish. So, um... I picked this, picked out all the bones, I deboned everything. I want the, I want a five year old to be able to eat this soup conveniently without complaining of the bones in it. So I picked everything out of it. For the beef, I have brisket bones and some beef. I got this beef yesterday night because I filmed this in the morning and it would be difficult to get brisket bones. So I have fried, but my fried is from side oil granite oil so that it will be very soft when i cook it then i have some diced bomo and some stock fish of course we'll be using some crayfish pepper ogiru bay and red onions for this recipe we are not going to use blender to blend it the way we normally blend it we're going to use a manual hand blender to blend this that is i don't just know there's this unique flavor that it adds rather than blending everything together so i'm going to use the hand blender to blend it then also have some seasoning cubes some salt and some onions for cooking the meats this is for the beef then i have my palm oil we can't make this dish without palm oil we have our palm oil here to begin i'll add the red meats brisket bones um stockfish but more diced but more I'll add some onions into it, seasoning, seasoning cubes, some salt, and add some water. I'll allow this to steam for the first 15 minutes so it can lock in all those taste from the seasoning cubes before I'll add extra water to it. So I'm just going to cover this and put it on the heat. Let it cook for 15 minutes. If you've been enjoying this video up to this point, please help me grow. Please subscribe to my channel. Please. So this has been steaming for 15 minutes. So the season is perfect at this point. Very, very all right. So I'll just top it up with some more water and cover it. Allow it to cook for another 15 minutes or till it softens. So at this point, this meat has softened. Everything is very, very soft at this point. The bomo is cooked, the beef is cooked. I'll just turn off the heat and set it aside and continue prepping the rest of the ingredients that's the vegetables. At this point, I was done prepping everything, and it's time for the party. Everyone is ready for the party. Yes, apart from one vegetable that is the uziza, you want to slice this uziza leaves when you're about to put it inside so it's not lose its flavor so you can see the level of the water to the meat very small water you don't need too much water for vegetable soup you just need a very small water small water so to it i'll add my ogiri bay dissolved one into it then i'll add my crayfish pepper and onions into it i will also go ahead and add my fish into it at this point add the fish and i'll allow, stir this around and allow this to cook for five minutes while it is covered, you have to cover it. Cover it, please. If you've still been enjoying up to this hour, please help subscribe to my channel. Please, I want to grow. I want to grow on this YouTube platform. Please help subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thanks a lot. Let's continue cooking. So this is five minutes later. I'll add my water leaf into this take note i did not mix the vegetable the water leaf with the beef i didn't mix mix the two of them together i just spread it on top of it and i added my palm oil directly on top of it don't mix at this point just leave it like this cover the pot and cook for under five minutes uninterrupted
five minutes later i checked on this it was smelling nice very very tasty very delicious but it needs to be adjusted um seasoning needs to be adjusted i needed to adjust the seasoning so i'll adjust this with some seasoning cubes and continue with the cooking process so look at how juicy this is it's not dry it's not dry at all at all at all very juicy very yummy i'm not even done and very good like this so this is me adjusting the seasoning so I'll just stir this around before we will add the remaining vegetables into it that's the ugu and the uziza leaves at this point i've sliced the uziza so that it will be ready to go in so I'll just add the ugu and the uziza at this point like the kitchen was on fire like the aroma in the kitchen was just out of this nation so that's it on how to make vegetable soup if you've not subscribed to my channel please do well to subscribe to my channel leave a comment for me in the comment section and like this video thanks a lot for stopping by my channel today it truly really means a lot to me thanks a lot like i'm very very grateful like i enjoyed filming this but the slicing of vegetable parts was very very stressful slicing of that vegetable and picking it a shadow water leaf thank you very much god bless you